So a $30,000 account turned into a, a $1.8 million account in the course of one year, only risking half a percent per trade. And I listen, I know that that just sounds ridiculous, right? So a lot of people are gonna, that's why we're gonna get into the nitty gritty of this because it's, it's one of those things where once you guys realize this, you'll stop swinging for the fences on everything, right? We don't need home runs, okay? One of the things I like to highlight, and that is that it only had a 45% win rate. Some of the things that were really, really powerful uh, aha moments for me, this realization that like win rate was what didn't mean jack shit to me, right? Like at all. In order to have more wins and be wrong less often, is by widening your stops. I can come in here and I can widen these stops to like really silly amounts, right? Like if your goal is to, you know, have a higher win rate, look, here you are. Now, and this is with a ridiculously, ridiculously wide stop, okay? Still only at a 62.8% win rate. Look at the expectancy. This is the aha moment. It's like, look, our ego feels better because we're right more often, but how, how does our bank account feel? How does the bottom line suffer due to us trying to be right more often? 